Today we're going to talk about how to properly back up your portal environment. Having a well-defined backup procedure is critical and we strongly recommend that you regularly back up your portal environment. It is especially important to take a backup of your portal environment before making significant configuration changes like applying the latest CF, changing the security configuration, or running a configuration task. It is important to understand that in many scenarios it may be quicker to recover the portal environment to an operational state by restoring from a backup rather than troubleshooting the issue. Having this option is especially valuable when working with production portal environments or mission critical portal environments that may be serving a large set of internal users where a maintenance window is required to make the changes and that fact adds time constraints to when the environment must be available again. This video is intended to be a summary of the backup and restore information in the Portal Help Center. Further details can be found at this link. There are three primary components to taking a complete backup of your portal environment. One, the Portal File System. Two, the IBM Installation Manager File System. And three, the Database. So let's talk about each of these components in a little detail. First, the portal file system backup. A portal file system backup is made up of four items. First, the portal server root directory. Second, the portal profile root directory. Third, the app server root directory. And fourth, the config engine root directory. In many cases, and in, an, and in a default installation, these directories are all located under a parent directory called WebSphere. If that's the case, then taking a backup of the WebSphere directory would have it covered. However, these directory locations are configurable and may exist in different locations on your file system. So please check your environment for the specific locations of these directories. The second component is the IBM Installation Manager file system backup. It's important to note that backing up the IBM Installation Manager file system is the step that is most often missed in backup procedures. Having a backup of the IBM Installation Manager file system is critical because if the IBM Installation Manager file system and the Portal file system get out of sync, then it becomes impossible to properly apply maintenance, including CF upgrades, to your portal environment. The IBM Installation Manager file system backup is made up of three items. First, the IBM Installation Manager Agent Data Directory. Second, the IBM Installation Manager install directory. And third, the IBM Installation Manager shared directory. Please note, there are two separate directories named Installation Manager. In this example, one exists under Opt IBM. and the other exists under VAR IBM. Further details about the IBM Installation Manager directory locations can be found in the IBM Installation Manager product documentation at this link. The third and final component is the database. There are several approaches to taking a database backup. Your DBA can decide the approach they prefer and or the backup utility they prefer to complete the backup. The important requirement for the portal environment is that the database backup be performed at the same timestamp as the file system backups we previously discussed so that the file system data and the database data are in sync once the environment is restored. 
Following these best practices to perform backups for your portal environment will allow you to quickly and completely restore your portal environment to an operational state. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you.